Jordan Walker, Geoffrey Walker Ayan, starts his 10-day journey covering 260 kilometers across half of the country to raise awareness of the devastating effects of climate change. He was flagged off by Goretti Kitutu, the State Minister for Water and Environment at Luzira in Kampala. Walker says climate change is one of the biggest crises facing humanity and is going to plant trees at stopovers, including famous Mambira Forest Reserve and the source of the Nile. As a citizen of Uganda, I should also contribute something towards uh, uh, environment conservation. So that is why I developed this idea to walk and create awareness and also encourage the population to plant more trees. So I'm beginning the work from here by planting a tree from Kampala to Kachora. Every district I'll be planting a tree as a call upon the population to plant more trees. Before flagging of Ayen, the Minister of State for Environment, Goreti Kitutu, urged all Ugandans to plant at least a tree or two and that officers in the Ministry of Water and Environment should lead from the front and plant trees at least five. Climate change as it is, is the monster we have to fight. And I must commend Mr. Godfrey or Geoffrey. For leading this, and I need to see more workers. He's now walking to Kaptora. I would want others walking to other directions to send similar messages to the communities. The minister led the Ministry of Fisheries and Environmental Activists from the World Wildlife Fund for Nature to plant trees which included indigenous trees with medicinal values such as Prunus Africana, which is used to treat prostate cancer. The representative from the World Wildlife Fund for Nature encouraged workers' cause and also called on the public to embrace the fight against climate change. The call for action is that everyone can actually do something within their means. For Mr. Geoffrey here, he's walking. And for you there, you could look at how you plant trees. Plant a tree, plant two, plant three, have a plantation, and we'll all be, be, be making a difference and a contribution to our nation. After being flagged off, Walker started his journey to Kaptura. He was followed by some members of the Uganda Walking Association and an ambulance from Luzura. Makere University Business School and headed for Mukono for the first stopover. The journey will take 260 kilometers. New Vision TV will be following Geoffrey Walker's journey and will be bringing you all the updates. This report was compiled by Gerard Tenua for New Vision TV.